Hi guys, today is going to be a special session because I have Dr. Sundar C, an interventional cardiologist from Kaveri Hospital, Chennai, to answer all the questions you asked me about cardiac issues, hypertension and exercises. Incidentally, Dr. Sundar is also my dad's cardiologist. So this is what he had to say when I asked him all the questions which you guys had asked me. Primarily, what they can eat, yeah. anything in the diet, yeah. exercise in the sense, yeah. what sort of exercise yeah, they can do and for cardiac patients, yeah. how to deal with emergencies in this period because it is something which we are not used yes, to at all. Yes, yes. So I would like your opinion on yes. that. Yes, and that's a beautiful uh, question. Actually, the first we can take uh, exercise proper. Uh, see, um, there, we can divide the people into two and those who have cardiac problem and those who doesn't have any severe cardiac problems. So sometimes they may be having a diabetes, they may be having a hypertension without heart problems proper like a heart attack or something. So for them we use, uh, we use a very good uh, protocol that is 150 minutes per week that can be achieved uh, by doing exercise 5 days a week. That means 30, day, 30 minutes per day. So the exercise can be split up like this. So those who are already doing exercise like walking, speed walking, stretching, running, jogging or cycling and in this coronavirus uh, period they may not be coming out uh, uh, so they will be just uh, uh, doing the exercise in their home itself. Yeah, it, that is correct. So this is not going to last for uh, so many months. So uh, in this meanwhile, we can maintain the same pro exercise protocol inside your home or if you have any terrace, you can you always do the exercise uh, there in the terrace and uh, provided you should maintain the social distance uh, distancing properly. And for heart patients, my personal advice for heart patients, I will never give any targets. So do go for four kilometers walk or go for two kilometers or, or do exercise for 30 minutes or do exercise for 45 minutes. Never, no, no targets. So just do whatever you can do. Just simple walking, it's enough. If you are becoming tired, that is the limit for you so that you can sit and get rest. This is the advice I usually uh, give for a cardiac patients whose hearts are very weak. And those who are not used for exercise or uh, not a regular exercise do yes, you can simply do exercise for each and every actions like if you want to drink some water which is say some 10 meters away from uh, a dining table is there so don't walk directly to the 10 meters just walk go around go around go around just count uh, 50 steps you have covered then go and take the water drink come then again take go walk go walk then 50 steps come and sit so within uh, two minutes you will be covering 100 steps so other type of exercise like stretching yeah that's good uh, stretching exercise are very good you can always do but never over stretch so i have been asked by a lot of my my patients that they are hypertensives but they are under control is there anything else they can do to improve their immunity against against the covid 19 in this time yeah uh, <clears throat> The whole body, the whole world body came with a strong statement that all the hypertensive uh, medications are safer. So what are called comorbidities is diabetes, hypertension, kidney disease, heart disease and other organs. So even though coronavirus can attack other organs also, the basic thing is coronavirus depletes the oxygen for other organs. So if the other organs, if it is already in a compromised position, they will go for more degradation. This is the risk behind the risk. So, so if the hypertensive, hypertensive patients who are already on a good health and they are maintaining the BP properly, they need not worry at all. Don't Because if they think of coronavirus again and again, they will become psychologically depressed, which in turn, in turn it will raise the BP. That's the only weapon. Uh, uh, to combat, combat the coronavirus is to avoid coronavirus. And the second thing is emergency is always an emergency. Whether it is a cardiac problem, whether it is a hypertension, whether it is a diabetes, emergency is always an emergency. Always you will have a physician um, who, whom you are following with. 
So immediately, immediately contact him, and then he will advise accordingly so that we can be comfortable. Okay. So finally, to summarize, one is exercise in moderation and listen to your body. If you're exhausted, stop exercising, relax, restart after some time. Eat healthy. Avoid salt. Water should be taken as much as you can. Finally, if you are a hypertensive and under control, go about your normal activities. Take your tablets. If you have an issue, call your doctor. So, Doctor Sundar, thanks a lot for joining us yeah. and for all all the fantastic advice yeah. given. And all of you, listen to the advice. Be safe. Be home. Be well. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you. Thank you. Doctor Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.